Hello and welcome to Tutorials Point. Today in mobile marketing, we will discuss about push notifications. What are push notifications? How and why these companies are using push notifications? And what are the benefits of push notifications? What is push notification in the first place? Push notifications are those messages that pop out to mobile screens using users asking a particular question. In the first place, we actually receive lot many messages from various companies, various manufacturers and retailers. In the first place, what happens is if you opt in, then you will be able to receive these messages from the companies and the manufacturers. To opt in, this is actually the first message that you will check out. Here, click on to allow to subscribe to notification. This is the message actually we receive in the first time. Click on allow to subscribe to notification. There are two messages, two options here. Later or allow. Some write actually not now here. Some say no. Some say yes. There are various options that the companies offer. This is normally the option that are offered by the companies later or allow if you click on allow it means you are allowing companies you are allowing businesses to send you the notifications once you do that you keep on receiving notifications from various companies push notifications are extensively used across many businesses to stay engaged with their subscribers if you if the companies want to stay engaged with the subscribers in terms of the products offered in terms of the discounts offered in terms of the sales offered in terms of various product services solution that are being offered by various companies they stay engaged with their subscribers with the end users and that is precisely the reason companies are extensively using this push notification system so that they can stay engaged with the end user. Users can always unsubscribe to any notification. If I opt in here, say allow and they start sending me the notifications, I can opt out any time by unsubscribing to this particular notification. That facility, that feature is always available with the subscribers and these are basically, this is basically what push notification is all about. Why the push notifications are used here? To send product updates, this is the number one, various companies actually coming out with various products and they want to inform their customers, they inform the end users and this push notification is extensively used by various companies to send their users the product updates, push discount offers. Now there are lot many companies offering lot of discounts and if you want to actually inform and engage your end users to the subscribers, they actually send push notifications about the discount being offered on various products to let users download the updated app. What happens is many companies have mobile apps and these mobile apps are continuously and consistently keep on updating with new features and new facilities. What happens is a new update in a particular app is available in the store. They send notifications to the end user, to the subscriber to actually update the app that they have downloaded. Utility messages like weather and traffic, they actually keep provide a lot of information besides from the discounts, besides from the products being offered. If you are traveling someplace, they offer the weather information, the traffic information, a lot many utility messages also are received in terms of flight check-in and schedule also lot of push notification messages are received by the end users. Breaking news and other news and updates. If there is a breaking news actually coming out and you are actually subscribed to a particular news app or a news website, they send you the breaking news as it is happening, as it is they are updating their websites. And these are the various types of push notifications the end user, the subscriber receive when they opt in, when they subscribe to this push notifications. How actually they work? Operating system push notification service, it is OSPNS, is iOS, Android, Windows and Blackberry. These native apps or the apps that are open source, they have their own push notification system and they use their own push notification systems. 
App publisher, the app publisher enables their app with an OPC in its P, uh, publishers upload app to App Store. And they have this OSPNS, which is basically an operating system push notification service. And the apps actually update their apps and the publisher upload the app to the App Store. And this is how actually the push notification works. Client app, this is an OS specific app installed on a user's device, it receives incoming notifications and this is entirely different from the OS PNS. Here what happens is the client app actually is an OS specific app and it means the operating specific app and they have their own system, they have their own methodology where the push notification system is installed in a user's device and they keep on receiving the push notifications with the various kind of services, solutions or the products information that the companies may offer and this is precisely how the push notifications work. In conclusion, what we have seen in this video is what is push notification, why push notification used and how push notification actually works. Thank you so much for watching. Hope to see you again.